What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It is Prometheus Rex coming at you with another video. And today, we are playing the classic Black Ops 2, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies. I am attempting the two box challenge on the map town. Uh, we are playing Black Ops 2 Zombies today in celebration and preparation for Black Ops 6. I'm super excited for that. I also love doing the two box challenge and have been doing it for years on multiple maps and it never gets old. I love doing the two box challenge because it just makes it so unique of an experience every time. Uh, for those of you who are not familiar with this challenge, here's how it works. I'm allowed to buy two weapons from the mystery box and I can buy perks as well. Uh, I allowed myself to buy the Semtex grenades and the Galvanuckles just for fun. So here's my first and second weapons. I got the Barrett sniper rifle, which is an interesting weapon for this as my first weapon. And then for my second weapon, I got the RPD, which is a light machine gun, which is a great gun for zombies. I'm very happy that I got that one. But I actually uh, was surprised that I got the Barrett. Sometimes when I play specifically on town for some reason, my first, my first box spin is the EMP grenades, like without fail, or the monkey grenades, which doesn't really work for this challenge. So I was super excited that I was able to actually get weapons on the first go. Here you can see me getting quick revive. Uh, for those of you who don't know or have never played Black Ops 2, there's multiple perks on this map. For solo players, there's five, and you can have up to four. And for players that have, uh, you're, if you're playing with multiple people, you get uh, this perk called Tombstone, which allows you when you get downed to, and die, you get to keep your all your stuff, all your guns and stuff. So uh, here we go. It is crazy to me that Black Ops 2 is 12 years old now. It's crazy. I've played the game since the day it was released, and it's by far my favorite Call of Duty. It's also the first one that I ever owned and played consistently, which obviously, you know, big nostalgia for me. Uh, I also am very excited about the zombies on Black Ops 6 because it looks like it's going to be similar to... Uh, Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 Zombies and uh, Cold War, which I loved all of those. Here you can see I'm getting Speed Cola, the second perk, which makes it so that you can reload faster. And uh, if in case I didn't mention, Quick Revive means you get another life if you get downed, uh, for those of you who have never played it. And because uh, Black Ops 6 is coming out soon, I'm super excited. For that to come out, I have a lot, a lot of big plans for the content that I want to make for or surrounding that game, and it looks like they're gonna give the Call of Duty fans what they want, which is a big deal when uh, Treyarch loves to listen to their fans and they listen to the feedback, and which is really cool because that's who plays the game, that's who enjoys the game, and here you can see. I am uh, starting to get a little bit of a groove on training a little bit and uh, for those of you who don't know uh, training is a strategy where you run in figure eights to uh, basically you get the zombies in a circle and it makes it easier to kill them and plus it saves ammo here I'm getting juggernaut for those of you who don't know that makes it so you get an extra hit from the zombies so it's easier to survive and uh, now, I mean, I'm already round eight, so it will be interesting to see uh, how far, leave in the comments, how far do you think I will get in this challenge? What round do you think I will die on? And how far you think I can go? And uh, please uh, leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And I will let you enjoy the gameplay. And uh, peace!
Oh! <laughs> 